Let's watch the ending of intermission with John Eric Bentley. I love this scene, by the way. So mm -hmm. freaking cool. good. Look at the graphics, man. I know. It's like the Book of Eli. Oh, wow, that's a good reference. I like it, because of all the, like, the desert hey, and stuff, lifeless planet. Were you really walking the whole way? Yep. <sighs> Calm's still pretty far, though, isn't it? Another full day, give or take. But we got red. <laughs> Question. When my mom says a full day, she means from the time you get up in the morning till the time you go to bed. Crazy! But for me, it means from the time you get up in the morning all the way through till the time you get up the next morning. So, which is it for you? Gotta go with Elmira on that one. <sighs> That's a relief. Is it, though? <laughs> Cloud! Red. Bet you've had to hoof it from sun up to sundown tons of times. This is all just same old, same old, right? That's right. But even so, we're all gonna need to stop and rest. Especially you. Yeah, yeah, I know. Anyway, marching into the unknown ain't easy. But don't worry, because I'm here to lead the way. <laughs> That's comforting. Of course it is. <laughs> All right, everyone, let's stop here for a minute. Leader's orders. Now breathe in that fresh air. Actually, scratch that. Let's, uh, save it for later. When we're not so close to Midgar. Guess this is goodbye, City of Mako. Look at that. Look at the clouds and the color of the sky. And there's a thing. Music. Ah, I love that music. Love yeah. Yep. Just like that. Cool. No way. A car. A cigarette. All you gotta do is put it to Red's tape. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You got a light red. <laughs> Barry says, I'll show you how it's done. Cannon throwing on it. Jokabo! What is it with these damn birds? <laughs> uh, uh, sorry about that. No need to apologize, man. <laughs> Love that thing. <laughs> one more, one last thing here. I love that. Man. <laughs> it's like Prompto in Final Fantasy 15. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Where's a roof when you need one? I gotta love what Brianna did. Gonna be okay? Me too. Me Cold too. Should be, but weird. My stomach's in knots. That's its way of telling you it's hungry. <laughs> Let's move. <laughs> bread. Look at bread. That is bread. If I had roller skates, it'd be a glow. <laughs> I don't fancy a glow. Didn't she um, actually wear uh, like a Tifa outfit like as a nod on that show? Uh, I, I don't know. I, I, I didn't see the show, oh, but I saw like a for, thumbnail. Um, I, I didn't know that for Glow? I, I've seen like a I picture and she was in her show. I, I'm pretty sure it was for Glow. And she was wearing oh, like the cool. white tank top and like kind of like the... It, it, you could that's tell cool. it was an obvious nod. That. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's cool. But man, <laughs> that ending scene, I just absolutely love it, man. You get a moment of just like downtime just walking walking to calm i just Man, think that's just a phenomenal lot of reprieves. yeah a lot of little reprieves. i was um 
the moment I was talking about with uh, Cloud wow. when he gave that that very subtle little smirk when everybody's interacting with each other and and you could tell Barrett's kind of like um like loosening up a little bit you know the 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 battle was just over and, and everybody's walking and Cloud kind of just smir- like gives that little tiny smirk it was very quick and it was like a, a moment. Of, of for cloud to kind of relax too like yeah and even the nod the bear gives to him like yeah i know you know it's yeah. like <laughs> you're right you called it and yeah i trust you now soldier you know what i mean so mm-hmm. it's, it's, it's cool it's it's i'm telling you square enix they put it down with this it's just <laughs> it's it's everybody who was part of this project it's just written well i mean final fantasy period is written well but Final Fantasy VII and then the retrograde and you know it's just written mm-hmm. well. So this is it's a good it's a very 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 good project to be a part of. For me, it's an honor, it's a privilege, and it's fun. Mm-hmm. And I never knew how big the fan base was, <laughs> and I'm just I love it. It's just it's like one of the greatest jobs in the world I have for me. What was it mm-hmm. like going back into the? Uh... And into the, I guess I don't know if you went back into the studio or not with uh, with COVID and stuff going on, but uh, to go back and be back as Barrett doing an intermission uh, ending. Um, it was different. It was weird to go back in, and you know, it's like, wow, there's so many different restrictions and mm. different things like that, and it was just there's a protocol here in California, and it was just so many different things that you know you you have to adjust to. Because of you have this has to be clean and it has to be a HEPA filter and it has to be these mm. things and so, you know, once again, our crew, our team, um, uh, the way it was conducted, the way it ran so smoothly, it was like, oh, it's just seamless. It's like being back in again. It made it seamless despite all of the changes that had to be made to be um, compliant for what the COVID restrictions were and for what studios were supposed to be and. You yeah. know, our studio and, and our, our casting director and every, they just made it so smooth. So it was great. 